Welcome to Sierra Streams Institute at the Woolman Campus. I'm Joanne Hild, Executive Director. And here we are in my office. The focus of our work is mainly on the Deer Creek and Bear River watersheds. And the thing that's really unique about us is that we do citizen science. We involve citizens in our community in everything that we do. And we do that because we really want the citizens to be empowered and educated so that they can make change using scientific knowledge. Hi, I'm Marianne Kreschka. I've been on the board of Sierra Streams and Friends of Deer Creek for 20 plus years. Uh, it's an organization that depends on citizens, citizen scientists to collect the data to help us preserve the health and safety of our community and it depends on all of you to donate as much as you possibly can to make it possible to preserve this beautiful and wondrous place to live and raise our children. My name is Nancy Fleming and I serve as the president of the board of directors for Sierra Streams. I've been in Nevada City for about eight and a half years and coincidentally right after we moved here I met a gentleman who was a water monitor on Deer Creek for a group called Sierra Streams and he thought I would be interested and I really was. It was exciting particularly because I live here on Deer Creek. So I did water monitoring for about five years and then was asked uh, to join the board. So I took a step up the corporate ladder and am now affiliated with the board. My name is Saul Henson. I'm the Education Program Co-Director at Sierra Streams Institute. Here at Sierra Streams Institute, we have uh, a number of different programs, including research, restoration, and education. Our education program uh, was created to capitalize on the research and restoration projects that are happening at Sierra Streams Institute. So we're getting volunteers out, we're collecting water quality data, we're doing restoration projects, removing invasive species and planting natives, and we want to get students in Nevada County involved in those projects. So what are we finding with all this data? Well, we're finding that there is a decline in salmon and spawning habitat, and so we are out there trying to improve that habitat so we can increase those, those reds and increase the population of salmon. We're finding that we have contaminants in our soils, in our waterways, in our organisms due to historic um, mining. And so what are we doing about that? Well, we're out there, we are restoring the land, we're removing the contaminants, and we're allowing these spaces to be used again as more healthy habitat for the organisms and for human beings as trails and, and parks. We also um, have had fires and destruction of habitat, and we're finding that. And so we're out there also improving that habitat. And as Joanne mentioned previously, it is the special aspect of Sierra Streams that we have citizen science engagement. This is what enables us to do the work that we have been doing. And we will need to have continued support and continued help for the future. There are a number of ways you can support us. Uh, the first is joining programs. The second, you can become a monitor, a citizen science uh, participant. Of course, you can donate any amount of time and also money. And all of this is very valuable and will help us move forward. So please go to our website or call us and find out more about how you can be involved and you help continue this really important and valuable work in our community. Thank you.